everybody's friend It's Tyler It's your only black friend Because your best black friend I wouldn't trade him for another black friend Cause black friends are rare as you should be aware He's mopping Richard Pryor So just sit and stare It's everybody's friend It's Tyler It's everybody's friend It's Tyler Hey guys, Sally here. So, for this video, I'll be talking about this whole entire trailer deal for this movie called Kieran, which is produced by the Black Entertainment Television Films division of that whole entire station. Now, first and foremost, I'm not necessarily surprised about that trailer. In fact, I was not even scared. Not one bit when I was just watching the whole entire damn thing. Mostly because, number one, it's super fashionable for Hollywood to just make remakes and remakes, sequels after sequels, and of course, base things off of memes nowadays. And so, now to this whole entire idea that Hollywood is not full of original ideas and original thoughts to make their products is not anything new to me. And so, when I came to a movie watching something called Kieran, I was not sure how it was going to happen. Now, this whole entire plot from what I seen from the trailer is essentially an urban black family moves in in some, some sort, of, sort of fancy house or whatever, and then they find this sort of person named Karen, who is supposed to be some sort of massive racist against black people. You know, what's kind of funny about all of this stuff is that from the narrative that I've seen so far from the far left of things is that black people are weak and that they cannot actually achieve anything including getting nice houses. And so, I guess it's kind of funny to show in the beginning of the movie of the trailer that a black couple got a nice house, but you know. It kind of ruins the narrative, damn it. And so now actually, throughout the whole entire trailer, it's supposed to be scary? I'm not sure about that. Because, honest to God, when I was watching that trailer, it was not even scary to me. Not one bit. Like, normally for horror movies, right, I'm looking for stuff that's like psychologically scary, right? or at least freaky, or something like that. Because the whole entire purpose of the horror genre is to creep you out with some sort of stuff, or have some sort of mind fuck in your mind. This here is not even like a B movie. It's not even an A movie. This is like a Z, low budget kind of movie that is like so, so bad. Like, how could someone actually be afraid about some sort of guy, like, there was like this moment, right, in the trailer, where they pick up some sort of soap, and it has like the confederate flag, like, it's not supposed to be scary! <laughs> like, it's not supposed to be like the most, oh my god, I can't believe this is happening! He she got some sort of confederate flag soap! Oh my, like, really? How is that scary? Like, I was like laughing my ass off. I'm not sure if it was intended to be like some sort of skit for Saturday Night Live or whatever, but man, if they're actually trying to make this into a real horror comedy, it would make so much sense on why it's like, you know, so hilarious. Otherwise, if they're actually playing it straight for this movie, I think, of course, it's just terrible. Absolutely just terrible. This whole entire phenomenon is not anything new, and at this point, it's a tired trope for like these sort of black movies. For example, this trope started, I think, with Get Out, where basically, of course, the black guy goes in some sort of white neighborhood to meet the family who's white, and of course, the white people try to fuck him over. Now, it's the same sort of story, but even straight, like, in a sense, I kind of like, you know, Get Out. It was kind of entertaining and sort of fun. But this here is like, you know, the same sort of story, 
both a Karen. It's like, it kind of reminds me a lot when I was watching Get Out, when I was watching this whole entire trailer. Because honestly, I've seen this story before, I know how it plays out, and so, yeah. I was not scared, I was, you know, more laughing at it than was scared. And so, number one, it better be like some sort of horror comedy. That's probably the only explanation I could justify to actually, of course, <laughs> make sure that this whole entire, why this whole entire thing was funny. Or, if it's not necessarily a horror comedy, then they're doing like some sort of terrible job. Like a really, really terrible job because the purpose of a horror movie is to scare you. Oh my god. But anyway, yeah, that trailer looks terrible. I'm probably gonna watch the movie just to see how terrible it is because, oh wow, it's just bad. It is just bad. What do you guys think about this trailer? Tell me in the comment section down below. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler. He's your only black friend, so he's your best black friend. I won't <laughs> trade him for another black friend. Because black friends are rare, as you should be aware. He smiles like Richard Pryor, so just sit and stare. It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler. It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler. It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler.